The manure enters the Dairy Tech one shot sand separator from both the flush system and manually when a skid steer pushes the manure in. The Dairy Tech one shot sand separator will then lift, rinse, and stack quality reusable sand bedding. After the sand exits the one shot into the pile, it can then be easily transferred to a second location for drying. After one day of drying, the sand will be moved to the large sand pile and it's ready to be used for bedding. In the one shot, as the sand is lifted to the top, the water and manure filters down and exits at the bottom of the one shot. The water and manure will continue through the cross auger. The cross auger will settle out any remaining sand and push it back to the one shot. The water and manure will flow into the mini sand lane, which will flow into the first reception pit closer to the Dairy Tech DT360. Next, the manure will be pumped into the Dairy Tech DT360 manure separator. All solid manure will go into the pit below the DT360 before being pumped to long term storage. I'm Case Holgenorn. Together with my wife Amanda, my mom and dad, we run Holgenorn Dairy in Baden, Ontario. We've recently added a new building for our sand separating process. Uh, we added a Dairy Tech one shot to separate and clean all the sand from the manure. We also added a Dairy Tech 360. Uh, it'll separate the uh, liquids from the solids. The main reason for adding this system is more consistent, clean sand. Uh, it also has clean flush water. This building allows us to uh, reuse the sand within one to two days. It's clean, it's dry sand, it goes right back in the stall within one to two days.